it's our duty as humans to, to honor them. To indigenous communities, the buffalo is more than just an animal. They hold a deep symbolism representing strength and unity. And for years now, there have been ongoing efforts to restore buffalo populations across eastern Washington. Thanks to a gift from the Kalispell tribe, this is becoming a reality for the Colville Confederation of Tribes. Our Alexandra cohen has got an exclusive look at this growing herd of buffalo. She shares how it's helping revive a piece of their history. Throughout this rangeland behind me, there's 45 buffaloes. The hope is to get that number up to 50. For both the Kalispell tribe and the Colville tribe, these animals hold more than just a nutritional or agricultural benefit. They hold a symbolic one. <laughs> That is the sight of 10 additional buffaloes being brought onto the Colville Reservation. It, it means a lot to our people and, and the land. To the indigenous community, the buffalo holds a strong significance. It represents resilience and sustenance. We have very high respect for them. We treat them with respect. We raise them with respect. Derek Bluff is known as the head of the Buffalo Boys, a group of family members that has been working closely with these animals for numerous years. I've seen them home my whole life since I was born, and they're just, they're just amazing. I just love them. You know, they're just always cool to look at. It's always going to amaze me no matter what. The Upper Columbia tribes have a history of working together. So when Bluff heard that the Colville were trying to start their own herd, offering a helping hand felt like the only thing to do. You know, it's just, it just what we do. I guess you'd say it's Indian way, I guess, but... The recent gift from the Kalispell follows last year's donation of 33 buffalo. Biologist Sam Rushing has been working closely on these restoration efforts. To him, the most gratifying part... A new species on the landscape um, that does provide um, a lot of cultural benefit to the to the tribe and a new subsistence opportunity, another protein source out on the landscape. Both tribes expressed a strong honor for these animals and a hope to restore buffalo populations for generations to come. Somebody needs to speak for them and that's that's our responsibility, not just with the animals but with the land. Reporting from the Colville Reservation, Alexandra Coneyarts, 4 News Now.